Hey, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here. So good to have you here and welcome back to the Silt of, Suit of Armour. Suit of Armour? Suit of Armour build. Um, great to have you here. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for joining along on this journey. Right, a few things have happened in the last day or so. I've sorted out a little bit of the Velcro attachments here for the uh, breastplate and backplate. I have uh, finished the face mask, so this piece going like this. Of course, we've also done the cross, and you saw that in the last video. We've done the cross on the uh, shield here, uh, and I've started uh, the sword, and so I've got a fair bit of the sword done. I'm going to coat it with Rust-Oleum Peel Coat. Now, online, a lot of people use Plasti Dip. Uh, Plasti Dip is about $30 a can. This is about $20 a can here. So uh, I'm trying to do this on a bit of a budget. Uh, still, I spent way more on paint than I really wanted to. So I'm going to coat it with that. That's going to seal all the sides, seal all the, uh, all the foam up. Then over top of that, I'm going to put Gloss Black. Uh, and I've bought um, some reasonably cheap gloss black, uh, $8 a can sort of stuff. I'm going to coat the whole thing in gloss black. And then for the majority of it, I'm going to coat it with this Rust-Oleum uh, Titanium Silver. Safety first. Always safety first. So, let's get into it. Well, I've uh, moved outside. So I've got this uh, respirator that I'll put on. Like so. And I'm outside. I'm outside, so I need sun protection. Otherwise, I'm going to look like a lobster. And this is the first two coats on here, uh, and you can see it's covering relatively well. I'm pretty happy with the way it's coming together. Black gloss. This is a, a black gloss that'll go over top. I hope that black's going on really well, and you can see it's starting to get a good shine to it uh, coming through there. In fact, if I bring it out to the sun, you can probably see there's a really good shine starting to come onto that. So I'm really stoked with that, and I think once the silver hits it, it's going to look really quite great. Rostolium metallic silver. Let's give it a shot on this pauldron and see what it looks like. So right now it is this uh, black color. Okay, and a nice thin coat on there, and it's going to come out, I think, a really fantastic. So you can see one side's been done, one side hasn't. Well, it started out as this black foam rubber, and now it's starting to look like shiny silver metal. In fact, if I actually pick this one here up, this is the helmet, and I bring it out here into the sun, you can see the metallic shine on that. Uh, it's looking really, really sharp. Oh. Right, I can breathe again now. But I'm really, really stoked from this black to this silver. Uh, from this black to this silver. Uh, they're looking really fantastic. Now it's about layering up the colors, uh, adding some texture. So um, various components like this one will have reds and golds added to them, and then some weathering in bits and pieces. But look at that. I mean, that, that actually looks like metal. And I'm really, really stoked with that. That's it for today. See you next time as we round out and hopefully finish off this suit of armor. Cheers! Thanks for watching. If you like these, please subscribe. Love having you on the channel. Great to have you around. And I'll see you all very soon for more swordplay and knights.